close your eyes and watch your breath. As it comes in, notice where you feel it. When it goes out, where do you feel it? How does it feel? Does it feel comfortable? If not, you can change the rhythm. Make it longer or shorter. You can make it heavier or lighter, deeper, more shallow. Try to find a way of breathing that feels good for the mind right now, because you want the mind to have a place, good place to stay right here in the present moment. Because all the important things in your life are happening right here. Now the media tell us otherwise. They tell us that what somebody else is doing someplace else is more interesting, more important. You put aside your awareness of yourself and focus your awareness on them. But what does that accomplish? It d distracts you from the fact that you're creating your life right now with each of your choices. <coughs> Maybe focus here, focus there, think about this, think about that. Those choices have consequences. And you want to make sure you're making those choices with good motivations, because it's the quality of the motivation that determines whether it's going to be skillful or not. If it's greed, aversion, and delusion making the choices, you can be pretty sure that the results are not going to be good in the long term. But if you're not paying attention, how are you going to know? If you're focused someplace else, how do you know? It's like having a factory where there's no quality control. It just keeps churning out more things. Nobody's checking to see whether those things are good or not. And then, of course, you get trouble later on when people come back and they say, well, this doesn't work or that doesn't work. The best thing to do is stop the problem right from the beginning. So where is the beginning? It's right here, and your choice is right here, right now. What's important in your life? What are the priorities? As the Buddha said, the big priority should be where are you creating unnecessary suffering, either for yourself or for other people? What can you learn how, to not, how not to do that? Well, first you have to see well, where is this unnecessary suffering. That's why you have to be in the present as well, to see what's going on inside the mind. Figure out what's necessary, what's not. Because some things, there are certain, certain kinds of stress in life that are necessary. I mean, you do have to think about the future, you do have to think about the past sometimes. Having a body means there's going to be a certain amount of stress, but you don't need to build extra stress on top of that. In the Buddha's image, it's like being shot with an arrow. Say there's physical pain in the body, it's being shot with an arrow, and then you shoot yourself with some more arrows. And it turns out the extra arrows are the ones that really hurt. So you want to look into this, so be very clear about what's going on right here, right now. As for things outside that other people are doing, pay attention to them when they're relevant to what you're doing. But don't let your attention get pulled away more than it has to, because you're going to miss out on an awful lot of important things that are happening right here, right now. So allow the breath to become your home here in the present. And as with any home, it, you move into a house and it doesn't really feel comfortable until you start adjusting it to what you really want. So at the first, the breath may seem a little bit unfriendly, but as you get to know it well, you begin to know, okay, this is a good time for long breathing, this is a good time for short breathing, heavy breathing. When you're feeling sleepy, you want to breathe more heavily if you're trying to meditate. If you're feeling tense, you want to breathe in a way that's more relaxing. You can use the breath as a kind of medicine for the mind. So you've got a home, you've got the medicine, you've got good food for the mind in here with that sense of well-being that you can create. All this allows you to settle down here in the present moment so you can be right here as all the important things are happening, so that you can adjust them in a the direction that you want them to go. <coughs> 